Hey race fans, welcome back to the channel. If you've ever wanted to know what goes into packing for a karting trip, you're in luck. I've got a six hour endurance race next weekend at Atlanta Motorsports Park, and I thought I'd get a little jump start on my packing so you can see what you may or may not need for your trip. Also, if you're just getting into endurance karting, this video may help you, so let's get to it. This bag is pretty small, so it doesn't hold a lot. Thankfully, it holds everything that I need. So I've got my cart suit that goes in there. That's already almost full. And then on top of that will go my rib vest. It's also in its own bag. So this can be dinged around. It can be thrown around in the baggage compartment. And I'm not worried about electronics getting jacked up or anything like that. Next in this top part is where I put my cart shoes. My cart shoes also have the cart socks. They're also in here as well so that I don't lose them. I grab my shoes, I want to know that my socks are in there and I'm not looking for them because, you know, socks always disappear. So right now I've just got three things in the suitcase. This bag right here is going to be emptied and this is a flat backpack that I can also put in here, which means I can also put all my stuff back into it. This has electronics, it's got my neck brace, it's got earbuds, it's got radios, it's got... Uh, wet socks. I mean, I put everything in this one I'm just storing. It's got my rain suit. My rain suit's also got to go in here because I think it might be raining. So look at that. There's the rain suit. What else is in here? We've got a neck brace, extra balaclava. Um, I've got these waterproof socks, which are really good. I've never used them before. They're by a company called Randy Sun. And I'm going to take them because last time when I did a four-hour endurance race there, it was soaking wet and my socks were miserable. And if you have wet socks, it's not very comfortable. So anything you can do to stay comfortable in the cart is always a plus. Let's see, what else is also in here? Uh, down here we've got chargers for comms. We've got extra other cables and stuff that I may or may not need. So basically this whole bag is going to get emptied out. I can pull that bag out and then reuse it later. Also, because of the weather conditions, I'm going to bring a clear visor because the tinted visor just does not work during a rainy weather. I've also made a checklist in the past that I keep using over and over so that I don't forget anything. On here we've got a helmet bag, we've got radios, GoPro gear, We've got my Autobahn backpack, which I'd mentioned earlier, neck brace. I've got my cart suit, my rib vest, my cart shoes with my socks, a yoga mat, which I also need to get. That means I sometimes use a yoga mat and it helps with the, the cushioning at the back and if going over bumps and stuff, it just makes it, your drive a little bit more comfortable. Earbuds, the iPhone charger, some shorts, you know, regular clothes, jeans, jackets sunglasses sunscreen is also very good even though i'm totally protected in the cart when i'm outside the cart you know and you're out running around and it's a sunny day you definitely want to be protected by the sun you don't want to sunburn when you have to get in the cart it just makes things miserable uh also my race underwear uh, my pjs toiletries and masking tape masking tape is used for if we have a table, we can go ahead and mark some sections off to keep our gear organized. If you've got like three or four drivers, then a table gets filled up and then all of a sudden it's your time to go on a stent and you can't find your balaclava, you can't find your radio, whatever. If you mark off a table or mark off a certain area that, that is yours only, you can kind of keep your gear that you need for your cart in that area. You really need to be organized because this is just gear that I'm bringing. If you've got three or four of the guys plus a strategist or whatever, they're bringing their stuff. I mean, you got other drivers sharing other tables. I mean, things get messy quickly. So the masking tape is just there for to mark off areas so you can be a little bit more organized for your team and yourself. Last but not least, definitely want to bring your helmet. The helmet bag that I have has uh, gloves in here, a balaclava. It's got... Uh, the, my little tools for swapping out the visor and cleaning the visor and stuff like that. So I will take this on the plane with me. 
I will take my little bag over here that's also gonna be used for clothes and stuff. I can put my electronics in there as well. So basically this bag is only used for uh, gear and stuff that I just don't mind getting banged around in the airplane uh, during flight. So that's pretty much it. I'll definitely leave the list that I keep in the description below as well as links to some of the products that I use, uh, the Randy Sohn wet socks, uh, the earbuds that I just recently bought, which I can't wait to try, and some other things. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the track.